For the fourth year in a row, the South Florida PGA and all of its professionals have recognized Del Toro Country Club's PGA, sorry, PGA Director of Golf, Jeff Nixon, as the 2010 President's Plaque recipient. This award is designed to recognize the individual PGA professionals for their extraordinary and exemplary contributions and achievements in the area of player development. This award considers the professionals' growth in the game. Sorry. The eyes aren't as good as they used to be. This award considers the professional's growth of the game leadership committee at the section and national levels, plus the impact made at his or own or her facility. Jeff has been honored by his peers receiving and receiving the 2006 Southwest Chapter Teacher of the Year Award and currently serves as section executive committee as on the sec section executive committee, sorry, as the growth of the game chairperson. This is why I don't read a teleprompter at Golf Channel. This is Jeff's fourth consecutive year winning the President's Plaque. Jeff, that's unbelievable. Four in a row. That's great stuff uh, from the South Florida PGA section. Come on up and uh, tell us how you did it. I got a few notes here. Uh, this year. This year. Uh, the first year I cut this, I didn't know I had to give a speech, so. I got it and I went to sit down real quick. Everybody looked at me like I had three heads. But um, I'd like to thank uh, First Meredith and the section office for all her uh, efforts in helping us out and getting uh, growth of the game uh, committee wants and needs done. Uh, I'd like to thank the committee, especially uh, Andy Scott and Suzanne Band, both golf professionals in the Southwest uh, chapter who have worked tirelessly in creating Play Golf America Days and other events to help uh, raise awareness about the game. I'd also like to say to Ron and Kurt, Ron Spag, Kurt Douglas, for being in the room and kind of surprised me tonight by being here. Uh, thanks for all your guidance and support at the national level. Without you guys, I wouldn't be able to do what I do. So greatly appreciate it, guys. I'd like to thank President Cox, Vice President Pieper, and um, most of all, Secretary Warren Bakke, because if it wasn't for Warren, I probably wouldn't have got involved in this. He really doesn't know this story. But the day we graduated uh, GPT level three, there were papers on the desk. and. Uh, on the tables where we were leaving. And Warren said, pick those up, look at those guys, you need to get involved, you need to do something. Okay. So I grabbed one and there was Play Golf America. And I think MG had just rolled it out that year. And I thought, wow, that would really fit into my club well. You know, I can grow the game and get some new members and new life into our club, which, which we've been uh, so grateful to do. And in this economy, keep, the, uh, keep our club strong and, and be able to renovate it and make it even better. So special thanks to Warren for saying, hey, pick up that piece of paper and do something with it. Um, and also to uh, my friend Andy Scott's uh, father, who the same night at that awards, at the, uh, when we got awarded our membership, saying to me, and we were very happy, you know, this is all over. We finally got to level three and become PJ members. And he looked at us and goes, your journey's only just begun. And I took that very literal, and ever since then I've tried to do the best I could to be a good PGA member and give back to the organization that made me a part of it. So thank you so much.